Good day, YouTube. I have Boy Chuck here. There's myself. And we have this. Oh, fuck you with the foil. It is Amsterdam Springbok. 7% alcohol, brewed in Toronto, Ontario, Canada by the Amsterdam Brewing Company. Uh, interesting fact. There's a Bok wearing a t-shirt on the back. Bok, if you guys don't know, is the thing for sheep, goat thing. I'm a bobber. Goat. Looks like a devil worshipper. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Anyway. Our award-winning double Bok. So, it's a double Bok. It is brewed to celebrate the arrival of spring. If you look outside, it doesn't really look springish anymore. Uh, Rich, creamy, and full-bodied. This strong lager uses seven types of malt. Seven types of malt. I'm, I'm, I want. It. I'm excited now. So this is the, this is like Big Buck Hunter, right? Double Buck. <laughs> I got my fruity glass here. Oh, look at that! It's a dark Buck. Very dark Buck. What, what is a Buck? A Buck. It's a gazelle. Ten. Well, I know, I know what, what it means. Well, basically, back hundreds of years ago, there was an English knight and a German duke who had a drinking contest, each drinking their their homemade brews. The English guy ended up passing out. And when he woke up, he after losing the contest with the German guy, he blamed it on a passing bock or a goat. So... Bock has been a style of beer since then, which so, the German so guys. If you ever drink homebrew. me, and I can wake up and blame like a passing hobo. Yeah, and then we'll have a hobo <laughs> brand of beer. <laughs> Clearly, it was that hobo with a shotgun <laughs> that is the reason why I failed drinking tonight. I get anyway, it, I get it. I get it. Okay, cool. One finger head, very deep mahogany. That actually smells pretty good. Very malty, caramel, toffee. I get some chocolate on there. You guys didn't save me. I'm in the bottle, eh? Okay. I'm sure Boy Chuck won't finish it. <laughs> Actually, it smells really good. You've already gone on to it, haven't you? Yes, I have. It's surprisingly not complete and total crap. That that means a lot from the Boy Chuck. <laughs> it's very soft, very smooth. I don't even, I don't really know if I'd say it's full body like they say it is, but it's pretty close. Yeah. Apparently the beer is now gone. Oh, Doppelbock. Okay, not it means, <laughs> it means double bock. Yeah, it's like doppelganger. So what's the official ratings? Chocolatey. Caramelly. Yeah. Malty. Oh, really yeah, not much really, bitterness. Really malty. Not I don't, much bitterness at all. Yeah. I got a nice sensation this, on the back of the tongue. I'm going to give it a... You know what? I don't even usually like Amsterdam products, and I'm going to give it like a 7.5. This is actually a pretty damn good balk. Yeah. Especially one from Toronto. Yeah. I, it's, I'll give it a 6. 6 and a 7.5? You, you like it and you gave it a 6. Yes. <laughs> and it, it's, it's not bad. I wouldn't necessarily buy it myself. A 6 but. means barely bad. <laughs> or barely not bad. I like the viscosity. I like the taste. Goes down easy. I'm staying with my 7.5. I'm a little curious. Pass it over. I, I generally don't like it when they add like chocolatey type stuff to to beer. And I stand by that. Oh wait, no, it's not as bad. I give it a seven. I don't know, you're finishing that. <laughs> well, For this video, it. I want to see you finish all three. All of them. three? All three. The last three beer? Start chugging. <sighs> Let's go, Ken. <laughs> this is what happens when you just let them pile up. Yeah, I, I'm the guy who cleans up the dregs. If he doesn't like this one, I drink it. If he doesn't like that one, I drink it. Yeah, okay. So we have three colors. We have the... The, 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 the citrus. Mead. The, the mead. citrus mead. The hippie tree stuff? Yep. Yeah, the double head, the hop head double IPA. And the doppelbock. Yes. All right. Amsterdam Springbok. All right, okay. give her. Clang. How are we going to get him out of the basement if he passes out? No, no, it just takes way It'll be interesting. I'm, 
I've, I've already worked out a, a very elaborate pulley system. <laughs> I'd say we could push it out the window. Are you gonna put mead on top of that? Yes, you yeah. do. You could, should, could have started with the mead. <sighs> it's your fault for not thinking through. <laughs> Playing Nancy. <sighs> Fuck you. <laughs> Excuse me. I give that mixture a seven. <laughs> All right, thank you for watching the online <laughs> round of your review. Good night. <laughs>